Hello guys, welcome back to Prospect Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here, Nigerians. This one, when I go here, go shock you. And this will make you to understand the kind of leaders you have. These leaders that are just only concerned about themselves. They don't know about the masses, but when they want to come there, they will let you know, ha, we are going for your own good. When they don't sit down, finish. Anything when you they talk, you're on your own. Nigerians, today is the third day of the end bad governance protests in Nigeria. We have not said head for our president. We have not spoken. Nigerians are calling him out to say something, and he has not spoken. Hmm. This will shock you to know that a call has leaked. How the FCT minister here some week came. When I know him talk, saying they he get he they prepared for the protest. This call don't leak. Say we came. Other Nigerian police to shoot anybody when they protest, you know, in Abuja. So you can now see where the FCT police, you know, get the morale, they do it and they do that first day and all that. If you see what the commission of police, you know, uh, did on that very first day, you understand that these people, they were well prepared. Now, because of when people don't, they talk this, this and that, now I come the men and they relax a bit. So Mwike actually ordered them. So made them shoot anybody when they see, when they protest. Now the question is why? He not even give them, you know, Eagle Square. He, he tried everything possible to make sure that he stopped the protest. But for him to do that, you know, say Mwike political career don't go. You understand? If you know that you are too big to lead the people, don't come close to the power. When people talk to you, don't come close to the power. You see the situation of things you tell us you are not hungry. That is just for you and your family members. The money one are the thief. You get. So even when you spend, you know they feel them because you did not work for it. Tell me how a salary earner of 100,000, 150, 200 in Nigeria will survive this kind of situation. You people told us. That removing first subsidy, Nigerians will benefit. You told Nigerians to sacrifice. Right from the day one, Nigerians have been sacrificing. What sacrifice has this leader made? You are angry because you feel that people, they want to, you know, disturb your government, this, this, and that. People should not protest. So people should not just talk. That is what these people are saying. Nigerians are, are now on the streets since August 1st. We are expecting the president to speak. He told us that it's a stone. Speak. He read the town when he won't do work. You know, they talk. Your tone does not mean that you go just come there, you go sit down on your tone. Walk there. You see the reason why people, they talk, say, no, go. You know, agree. You understand? The country has turned upside down. All the policies is anti-people's policies. And if he said the policies is for... The good of the people, they are saying they are not comfortable with it. Why can't you just make a U-turn? Because it's the people you are serving. You said it's the people that elected you. That is what Tunubu said. It's the people that elected you. Can't you listen to the people you said they elected you there? We care. They tell people, they tell police, make it, make them buy Nigerians when they protest. Say that they're hungry. For streets. Because they don't tell mayo for Nigeria. They have forgotten that everything on this earth is temporary. They see 20 days, somebody was there before he came. And Sunday is going to leave the city, go still leave this world. All the money and everything he go leave them. So life is vanity upon vanity. Meanwhile, uh, as the protesters, the, the protests erupted nationwide on Thursday, uh, the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, that is this year's on week, uh, was seen at the presidential villa in Abuja. The former River State Governor arrived in a black Toyota Prado SUV and presided to a meeting with President Bola Tinubu, believed to address the ongoing hunger protests centered in the FCT. The capital witnessed massive demonstrations even when he tried you know, to stop them with crowd 
flooding the central business districts and subs. Security forces responded with tear gas to despair the protesters. Despite the unrest, the minister Nwike emphasized the government's willingness to engage in dialogue with the demonstrators. When he don't see, say, the matter don't big pass him. You no go fee overpower the people. It's not possible. During a ceremony for four newly coronated chiefs of uh, Karu Kwali Pai and Yoruba Nwike praised the protesters last last for maintaining peace and urged them to continue this approach. He stressed the importance of dialogue, stating he who makes peace will, at the end of the day, enjoy the dividends of peace. Okay, so according to the Punch report, Nwike said, I want to commend you and urge you to still talk to our people that we are still ready to talk to them, have a dialogue with them, and iron out uh, the, the gray area. Nwike uh, highlighted Abuja's role as a center of unity for Nigeria and called for collective effort to address the nation's challenges. He expressed confidence in Nigerians uh, President Tunubu's administration urging patients for positive change. According to the traditional rulers, Mwike underscores their crucial role in connecting with grassroots communities. He noted that they are pivotal in communicating government policies and um, the public sentiment. You are the one who knows what the people feel at home. Okay, so this is what they are telling him. But currently, uh, he's trending. President Bola Tunubu must go. You understand? Even right now, Nigerians are like, oh, we don't even need this bad governance again. What they're asking right now is for uh, President Bola Tunubu to leave office because he has failed the people. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly drop your comments below the comment section. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you and bye for now.